All right, so I just got back from a trip to the park with my wife and my daughter, and so I thought I would give you a quick look at how I have my GR1 21 liter loaded out for a day at the park. Um, I don't have any work stuff in here, no laptop, um, so pretty light, um, but it's basically my dad bag. So this is a GR1 21 liter. Um, this bag is from 2015, 2016. I didn't, when I bought it on the secondary market, I didn't realize that this is the model that has the curved straps. So originally designed for men with broader shoulders and women. I've contacted SCARS to have these replaced with the current version of the shoulder straps. That said, they're not that uncomfortable, so it's fine. Um, so let's go ahead and take a look at how I have this loaded out. Okay, so starting off here on the outside of the bag, I've got a medium hero clip, a thin blue line Arizona flag patch in the slant pocket. I just have my wallet. This is a spine wallet, a really nice minimalist wallet. I've got a tile in here. Really love this wallet. Gotta have a bottle opener. Um, and I don't keep anything else in here. So, opening up the bag. Let's take a look here at the top opaque compartment. Have my keys on a patch panel lanyard. Some Duke Cannon lip balm. And just some ibuprofen. Next in the mesh compartment, this is where I keep my medical stuff. All right, so my medical compartment here with the mesh cat gen 7 tourniquet a buff some flushable wipes and a small first aid kit in a lock sack then the main compartment so again this is set up as my dad bag so let me walk you through what i have here all right so starting off at the top here some wipes and some diapers. Next is my Maxpedition organizer. This just has tools, flashlight, everyday things that I might need. I'll do a video on this at some point. I have my TPG black med pouch. This is my trauma kit. Um, behind those, I have a shemog, and the reason I keep a shemog in my dad bag is it can be a blanket for my kid. We can use it for shade. Um, I can lay her down and change her on it, so this comes in really handy. Um, before I get into this, back here I have a Safeline Defense Backpack Armor panel. Um, so this panel is a ballistic panel um, from Safeline Defense. Always good to have ballistic protection. I have some shears, and then let's slide this back here. Last thing is, this is my Air City Sling 2, the X-Pack edition. Um, I've done a video on this, which I'll link to, but this is great because if I'm going someplace where I don't need to take my whole bag, or I can't take my whole bag, I can grab this and it has my everyday essentials. Um, so, love this sling. Um, I'll link to, again, that video, but it fits absolutely perfectly at the bottom of my bag. All right, so let me load this back up and we'll wrap it up. All right, so we got the Air City Sling. Go ahead and put the Shamog down, the Maxpedition pouch, the med kit over like this. Trauma pack is in there. Diapers and wipes. And then we've got our first aid kit, the dad wipes. Um, cat tourniquet and the buff. And as a matter of fact, I'm just going to go ahead and throw the buff right in here. Go ahead and zip this guy up. All right. And then top pocket gets the chapstick, Advil, or ibuprofen, keys. This guy up, and lastly, wallet. Bam. There you go. That's how I would load a GR21 for um, a day out to the park with the family. Hope you enjoyed the video. We'll see you next time.